Eric's Budget Biking Tips A guide on how to save money while riding Getting into riding is costly, so saving money after that is key. Testing the reliability of your bike is important to saving big. There are two ways to do this, uncalculated or methodically. We shall begin with a methodical approach. That's rough. At first, take an easy slow line, then aim to go faster and harder. Arr! That was much closer, but not quite there. We can do better. Uh. Testing the chain ring here. Make sure to misdiagnose what broke. Yep, my chain's broken. It might be fine. Now we move to the uncalculated method. Send it and bend it. This was meant to test the brake lever to see if it needed upgrading. It failed! Holy oh, fuck, your face is all black. Man, that was sick. I seen you, but Eric died. Yeah. And I probably need a new front brake hose. In some cases, you can immediately retest to see if everything is fine. Better. Here's another example. Oh, my rib. Keep going. It'll probably be fine. Oh. I don't know what that was. Ah, uh, I'm flat. <sighs> oh, I actually blew the wheel. Cool. Not this time! A third way is the out of your control method. Things just happen. Ah! I just blew my chain too. Why is everything breaking? I had no issues all year and then I go on a trip. If you've tested everything properly, these events should be rare and easy to repair. It broke. After all this knowledge, you can actively prevent damage to the components that can't take a hit while you're not worrying about the ones that can! Ow! Uh, fuck's sake. Ow, my bike! Uh. Eric mostly manages to hold his bike off the rocks as he's falling to prevent maximum damage! Kinda! A little! Perhaps! <laughs> this has been Eric's Budget Biking Tips.